Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. In this video, I will show you how to install MySQL on Windows 7 operating system. In the Google search engine, type MySQL, enter, click downloads, MySQL community downloads, click the first option MySQL community server, click on it. Come to the bottom, MySQL Community Server, the version 5.7.17, select operating system, it's a Microsoft Windows, choose which operating system you have and select OS version is 32 bit and 64 bit. If you don't know OS is 32 or 64 bit, here is how to check, click the start button, right click the computer, properties. Here is the system type is 32 bit operating system. So I chosen 32 bit. Now download. Here one important note my SQL installer is 32 bit but will install both 32 bit and 64 bit binaries. So come to bottom choose to download my SQL installer web community 5.7.17 download come to bottom if no thanks just start my download here in the bottom the installer package is downloading after downloaded double click it run my SQL installer contains four steps first one is a license agreement click the checkbox I accept the license terms I click next See, these files must be installed to download these products so I'm clicking one of the product and execute I agree the license terms and condition install setup successful now the requirements are installed now you can see the green tick marks click one or more products see this file this file the python 3.4 is not installed if you want if you want this product to connect the python this software must be installed click next yes now the installation process click execute After installation, all the products are successfully installed and the status is complete. Click next. Now product configuration. Click next. Click next. You need to create a root account password. And the password length must be 4. After set the root password, click next click next click next and execute click finish so now the configuration complete click next connection successful next execute click 
finish to continue next the installation procedure has been completed finish so here now my SQL workbench has opened file database connect to database username is root and the password we just created student wallet and the password is okay that's it if you like this video please leave your valuable comment share this video and please subscribe my channel catch you on my upcoming videos